What's going on guys, Kevin Fox here for Fox Fishing 4K. So today we are out on Georgian Bay and we're after some muskie. Uh, I've got Nolan here, Ryan's here. Uh, we just hit a 43, we're hoping to get a little bit bigger, maybe around a 48, 50. 50 is usually our goal that we try to go for. This rod here, we're running a believer. This one has a believer, this down rod. That one there has got a bucktail. That's what the uh, muskie hit on. And I'll show you my graph right now to show you guys kind of what we're fishing here. Here is what we're running here. We're running around three mile an hour. You can see this edge, it's like 14, 17 feet. We run along this edge, I'm scanning right now, and we're running this deeper drop here. So if I look at the, the bottom here, let's see if I can pull it up. 21 feet, 22 feet. We'll go down to anything over 27 feet, and we're basically following along that shoreline. Any little humps that come out, we try to go over. If there's two big rocks, we'll go in between them, but we're trying to stay in that 22 feet of water. As you can see here, there's a hump coming up. You can see that right there. Hopefully you guys can see that. We'll end up coming up around here, around that, and then we'll come back in around Gore Rock here. Um, you can see there, that's Wabashine Channel up there, just right out in front of Victoria Harbor by the Red Can. And uh, here's what we're trolling with. As the year progresses, we'll go to bigger baits. So we'll move to stuff like this, 14 inch. That's that guy. Here's another one, this is a mega lure. Uh, this one's like walleye pattern. So once the water gets a little colder, we'll start running some of these bigger baits. But right now, for early fall, we will run Bumblebee Believer. This is a good bait for fall muskie. This one here, any kind of perch pattern, either jointed or solid body, doesn't really matter. Uh, this time of year, I kind of like the jointed, get a little more action, a little more vibration in the water. The fish are a little bit more active right now because the water's warmer. We see a couple follows or we have something near the boat and we want to cast, then we'll move to something like this. These are a Medusa. These are the smaller ones. We'll go to a larger size come in the fall. Again, a big pattern that you're always going to notice for us out here is natural colors, either perches, whites, uh, the closest you can get to like a walleye pattern. Um, yeah, we really like these. Here's another one. This one's believer has taken a lot, a lot of uh, pike over the years, or, or musky and pike, but that's like a fire tiger perch. But uh, real bright colors, guys. And what we're doing is we're running actually long leads. A lot of guys I know, different lakes, St. Clair, different places, they're almost running prop wash. We don't run prop wash. We're we're primarily running long leads. So the bucktail, which caught a fish, uh, I think you're about what, like 100 feet? Yeah, like 80, 90. 80, 90 feet back there. Uh, it's got a one ounce lead weight on this one, so it'll dive down pretty good. We're using the cannon rod holders. We bring these down to the lowest setting there is. Keeps that tip nice and low. And I bet you he's, I don't know, three, four feet under the surface. We got the one down rod. This one's still got 60, 70 feet out on it on a deep setting. That'll dive us down or anywhere around 14 to 16 feet of uh, water depth. And when we're in 22 feet to, right now we're in 30 feet of water, we're running the mid, mid water column. Uh, a lot of times we're not fishing right near the bottom for these skis, we're fishing the mid column or the upper. They're a predatory fish, they're gonna come up, they're gonna smoke it. Uh, so you don't really have to go right down near the bottom for them. You can get them down there, but chances are, if you're going above their head, they see it. They're gonna, they're gonna come up and smoke it. So I would rather be above any fish than below it. So there's a couple uh, tips for you. We're gonna get back at her. Uh, we got the one. We'll cut to that now, show you guys that. Hopefully we get another one and something a little bit bigger. Let's go. Yeah, I got one. Yeah, hang on. Fucking right, I got one. Yeah, yeah. Here, Nolan, grab the camera. Here. This one. Okay. 
Got him? Keep the tank, keep the tank. Big, but well, we'll see. We'll see. Fighting good? Oh, yeah. Okay. Right. We'll see. She might get big here real quick. Hey. Musky, buddy. Good one. Yeah, yeah. You got a good one. Bring it over to me. Bring it. Oh. Tip down. Tip down. Here, Nolan. Nolan, just film. Just film. It's a good ski. Holy shit, that's good. Yeah, yeah. Okay, come over to me. Keep coming over to me. Keep coming. Oh, Keep coming. We got it. Let's go. Let's go. Got it. Holy okay. Let's go. Watch it. 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 Yeah, hold the weight. Try, try, hold the fit. No, don't, don't hang it. Yeah, there you go. Support the weight. Yeah. I want to make sure she's gonna kick off pretty good. I said we no giant, but we got a 43. But warm water still, right? So we're kind of babying them, right?